Hey you, Night Owls! My name is Nox, aka Mako, and welcome back to Sim Airport. Well, this is my second time actually trying to play this through because something super unbelievable actually happened. I don't know if it's because of the utilities, or if it's queues, or if it's taking out loans, but whenever I ended up building something, the builders kind of just got stuck in the walls, so hopefully it's not going to happen. I'm going to just, hold on, there might be a flight actually stuck, because that happened last time. Yes, there is a flight actually stuck, so let's break the deadlock, because there is a flight coming in pretty soon, and I would like that one to actually arrive, because we need the money. Yeah, I know a few people are going to be really, really mad, but that's because ticketing is a problem. We'll take care of ticketing in a second, though. The problem here is that I was trying to build foundations over here, and we kept running into problems. Like, big, big problems. So let's see, let's go for uh, that. And if the builders get stuck, then I don't know what to do. <laughs> I honestly don't know what to do, because I just kept having them like, try to build this out over here so we can get our security area over here, and they just got stuck in the walls. It was super ridiculous. No, look at that, they're not getting stuck in the walls. So I'm thinking it might have something to do with loans. If we take out loans, uh, they're going to get stuck in the walls. Or it might be something with ticketing or queues. I'm not going to touch anything until I actually build in what I need to build in. So <laughs> let's just get most things built in. I know ticketing is a big mess. So I'm going to leave that as is despite the mess. Okay, let's just close this up right there. And I actually am going to build in some more ticketing kiosks. Because I don't believe those are the problems. Things actually worked pretty well even after we got those. So let's just, uh, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six. I know I shouldn't put them that close to everything else because that's just going to be a bigger mess, but, well, I want to just save this space for other things that we need. All right. <laughs> oh, there's no door. There is no door. My bad, you guys. There we go. There's a door for you. You guys can leave through there. I know you can. I know you can because that's the thing that you guys do. All right, so those guys are just staying in there even though they know that they can get out. There we go. I was like, seriously? Seriously? And we're building up this fence so actually, you know, we'll be able to actually make this a proper secure area pretty soon because Rod H suggestion to actually put security here is superb. I like it so much. But the thing is that we're going to have to build up a lot of fence if we do that. And I want to maybe save up on doing that because we don't get our money back from fencing. And oof, building in the foundations basically going in the direction that I planned anyway. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Um, why are you all... Oh, maybe your flight left. Also, we do have a, an extra slot for morning flights. Let's see. You have a morning 787. You know what? I'm going to accept that. Let's accept that. Ooh, some more money. Good. All right. So where is that? Let's see. We have that. Is that what it... Nope. That's not it. This one. All right. So... What do you have going on here? We have a 777 and a 747. That's good enough for me. However, we need to leave two and a half hours there, so that's probably good. We can definitely try that. Now, I know there's two big flights at the same time. These two. So I want to swap one of them out. I don't know which one. I guess it could probably... Yeah, you know what? Let's swap these two over here. Let's just... Oh, excuse me. <laughs> let's just swap that out. And that should be a little better. All right, so let's see. We want to work on this gate first. So that has two and a half hours. That's good. I'm thinking that since this flight is a lot smaller, we're going to just leave maybe like an hour and a half. Honestly, we don't need that much time. So that's going to be another two and a half hours there. This one has uh, well, less people, actually. Uh-oh. Um, huh, Let's just swap these two out then. Oops, excuse me. Is that a 747? That is a 747. Uh, what do I want to do? What do I want to do? Uh, that's... You know what? We'll just swap these two. There we go. All right. So, 747 needs two and a half hours. It has two and a half hours. Good. And this one... I hope that's good enough for it. Honestly, I don't know if it will be. This one doesn't need that much time. I can probably just close that in like that. And maybe that's going to be okay because that's a... Yeah, maybe. We shall see. We shall see how that works. All right, so that's 747. Like I said, it needs two and a half hours. That one's going to move all the way up there. This one is 777. It doesn't need that much time, but I guess that's going to be okay because they're all pretty staggered right now. So yeah, let's try that for tomorrow. Obviously, it's not going to work today. And oh my gosh, that's actually a lot of angry people. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Um, There we go. Final approach. Thank goodness. And Smart Air Lux, I still can't believe you. I still cannot believe you. I am not happy at all with what you did to us. All right, so let's try continuing on with this building here. Can't really build out too, too much because we get little bits of money every now and again. But you know what? Any little bit that we can build is going to be good enough for us because we need to continue building out this way, building up, then building out this way because I do want to get in the security as soon as is possible. I don't like where it is right now. And since we're going to move the baggage claim over here, we can probably just like have security going in through here. So we don't actually have to wait. Do would we need more fencing? I don't think we'd need more fencing. I'm trying to think of how this, this would actually work. 
If we have our doors coming in from the south... No, we're going to have to fence this off, actually. We're going to have to fence, like, down here, which might be okay, though. Because it's going to be, like, less fence than this. Hmm. I'm trying to think of just how this would work. This has to stay there until we actually build the rest of this building. Gotcha. I was like, can we get rid of this now? No. The answer is no, because people will just immediately start running in there like crazy. So let's not get rid of that until the very end of maybe this episode. I don't know. We'll see just how much we actually get done this episode. Because it's all a thing about money. And right now we are getting a fair amount of money. I don't want to charge more right now. I want to. Like, okay. I want to charge more, but I won't. Just because I know, like, you know, that it can become a problem. And I can't take out loans because I think the loans is what's bugging out the game at point at times. So, yeah, not going there. <laughs> Uh-oh. Oh, no. We lost a flight, you guys. There goes that money. Well... Should have kept a closer eye on that. My bad. All right, so these two are coming in pretty close together. Let's see. Gate A1 is probably super empty right now, huh? Yeah, it is. Gate A2 is... Oh, boy. Really, really late. It's waiting on what? Waiting on baggage loading. Where are our cars? Seriously. Like, you guys need to leave, like, right now. You're coming. You're you're really, really slow. Where's the other one? Is it still in there? It's probably still in there, huh? Wait. No, 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 no. It's not even in there. What? Wait, why is it... Is it stuck? No. No, don't tell me it's stuck, please. I'm th you guys, I think it's stuck. I'm pretty sure it's stuck. Well, there goes that functionality. All right, let's just buy another one then. Ugh, jeez. All right, there we go. We have two now again, even though that one... Ugh, can I actually get rid of... We can sell it. Yeah, there we go. So okay, sold that one. I guess it's probably the one that's still stuck. Because I see two of them right here. And it's actually... St <laughs> oh, gosh. We can't even buy a new one because it's still just stuck there. We can't even break... Oh, okay, well, that's weird. Interesting, weird. Call it whatever you want, sure. Uh, let's see. So we have some more money. I think I want to actually fix up ticketing a little bit. I... Oof. It's so tempting to do so, but... Wait, whoa, 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 what's going on here? Where's the rest of the staff? They're probably... They probably went up to the gates, huh? All right, fine, fair enough. What the... Uh-oh, uh-oh. Did your flight just leave without you? This is departing, probably. Well, I apologize, and I hope that it never happens again. Gate E1. Uh oh, it's at this one's at gate. Okay, what's happening here? What is happening here? You are waiting on package loading. All right, is this stuck again? Because if that's the case, we're just gonna send you off. Because clearly that one's waiting. Uh huh. So let's see. There's one baggage car there. Where's the other one? Please do not tell me it got stuck too. Please. There's three objects. Gate, car, okay, so that's not it. Where the, okay, there it is. Is this one stuck now? Oh, come on! No, no way, you guys. No freaking way. I think the cars are getting stuck. And there's no way to break the deadlock on them either. Um, hmm. Huh. Well, this is unexpected. <laughs> this is, I mean, you know, I guess it is kind of sort of expected because it is a game that's still in. Alpha, but still, just uh, frustrating. All right, so let's see. How much can we build out? We can't build out too much more. Let's just go for a 10 by 10 in this one. Because right now, we are waiting on... Oh, we're still waiting on flights, so that should be okay. Yeah, that one's now stuck. So the baggage cars are getting stuck at the gates. That, I am definitely going to report that, because that's a little bit too ridiculous for me. I know, I'm, you know, I'd probably make it fixed if I reload the game, but still, no. Nah, not good enough for me. All right, so ticketing seems to be okay now that we actually have all three people on there. So never mind. I was like, mm, maybe we need to add some more ticketing desks, de decks, desks to this. But no, that was not the case. It was just because there wasn't enough staff actually manning it. Fair enough. And are we... What the heck? Ugh. That's that's really unfortunate. That is, like, super unfortunate. We could sell and get... What? Do we pay $1,000 or do we get $1,000? Because seriously, we're not using either of those now. Oh, well... We're going to have to build another hangar, huh? Hey, we got some money. Look at that, you guys. We got money for things that are stuck. <laughs> oh, boy. Well, you good luck, you. I guess we could probably build another hangar, huh? Yep, that's what we're going to have to do. Just so we can maybe get some other cars. Although, they might just get stuck, too. So, I don't know the thing. How much is this? 46000 Okay, so just a few more flights. Are we waiting on anything? Ooh, E1 is going to have to leave in a second. That makes sense, though. Okay, so it's leaving. Good. No wonder, you guys. No wonder... The flights have been leaving so late. I thought that maybe we were having issues with ticketing or security. No, not at all. The problem is with the freaking baggage cars, of course. All right, can we actually fit this over here? No, we can't. 
Uh oh. All right. So we're going to just temporarily put this in here, I guess. And we'll move it later because I really, really. Oh, you know what? It's okay. I think it's okay. Let's put it there. And hopefully we can probably do the same thing over here to make it, you know, just just even. Even enough. All right. So one baggage car. I'm so sorry, you person. I, you're just working alone. And I understand how, how much that's a struggle. I understand your struggle. Oh, that is so messed up. All right, so hopefully, you know, this is gonna get remedied soon. I have very little faith that it will be, but there we go. We are building that up and we'll be able to buy some new cars soon. I'm gonna buy two just in case one of them gets stuck again. I don't know if it's just gonna be like one per, and if that's the case, that's gonna be really dumb. Wait, can we not? What? What? I'm super confused. Well, now we have two. Oh, please don't tell me it's gonna be one car per hanger. If that's the case, we could probably just go for a small hanger because that's these are too expensive to just keep, you know, buying them. That looks like it might just be the case. Okay, well, we're getting small hangers from now on, you guys, until this is remedied because clearly, clearly this is not friendly at all. Mm -mm. So that's just that's just fine. All right, we lost a flight. Uh oh, we lost <laughs> lost a pretty big flight too. Oh boy, yeah, there's just way too many problems here. Um, did not foresee that happening. That's just... That just came out of nowhere, honestly. I did not see that happening whatsoever. Alright, so we have not enough money to actually continue building this out. I'm gonna wait until we have another 50,000. I'm not gonna take out loans, because I think the loans are still bugged out. And that should be okay. Security exits, we'll be able to put them in as soon as we get maybe mo most of this building built up. But again, it's gonna cost a little bit more. And yeah, I can, you know, I can forego building a lot of the foundation to actually do other things here, but I kind of want to get the foundation in because we're going to have to do that eventually. And I mean, we are earning enough money now that we can afford it, but it's just <sighs> problems like that that keep getting in our way. Oh boy. So uh, yesterday we actually lost a lot of flights because the fail to reserve gate, fail to reserve runway. So today I'm actually going to take a close, close look at it to see just what happens here. I did actually continue building this out. I uh, don't know if this is the best idea, but you know, I, I seriously want to move baggage claim into the proper area so we can actually make the rest of this uh, secure area. Let's go ahead and actually take a look at what we have right now. Secure areas. All right, this is the only secure area up here, obviously, that's supposed to be the case. What I want to do is I want to make sure that this like place over here and this over here is secure. So after we build that building in, we're going to make a fence over here it's just to make sure that all of this is secure. That seems to be what we have to do, but uh, of course we're gonna need a lot of money. We should be making 231,000 today if we don't miss anything, which of course we missed a lot of yesterday. So we have to keep a very, very close eye on this just to make sure that some of the package cars are actually working. Cause I see one, there's one, there's definitely one. Let's see, there's another flight actually landing right now. Is another baggage car gonna come out? Yes it is, okay, good. Whew. Okay, so we have two. <laughs> so these are definitely functioning as just small hangers for now. Which is rather unfortunate because I would have preferred to get maybe just two for each side of the the airport, but clearly that's not gonna work if they're not functioning properly. Alright, that was oh my gosh, that left very, very soon. Okay, not that late. Good. Good. So we're definitely gonna be able to get these flights in. Let's see. The one that should be getting in is this one. That one's definitely gonna be on time. Good. It's gonna be a pretty big flight though, so we have to watch out for that one just because we're gonna get this one in coming in. A little close to when that one's, you know, supposed to be leaving. So we really have to keep an eye on this. This one's already a little bit too late. Let's see. The next one's just coming in at 9. So you have about half an hour to leave. Let's see if it leaves within the next few minutes. No. It's actually having some problems. All right. Got to get out right now. Oh, never mind. It's leaving. Okay. Whew. Now the runway might be a problem. Yep. Failed to reserve runway. Let's see. Late. You're leaving. Good. Final approach. Okay. So that one's super, super close. I might be able to actually fit in. A little bit more space. Let's see. The 787's over here, right? Um, actually, I actually have to watch these two. I have to watch if the 787 has enough room. There's only 169 people on this flight, so that might be a little too few, actually. I thought this flight may have more people, but no. It's supposed to have, like, what is it? 300 max? It only has 169. I think maybe the amount of time I gave it is more than enough. Maybe. It's supposed to leave... Uh-oh. It's supposed to leave at 11. Um, how much time does it have until... It has until not that one over here. Has half an hour. How are you doing? One people, two people standing in line. Come on, gotta leave. Gotta leave. You're waiting on baggage loading. Aha! That's the problem. Alright, so 
You're supposed to be coming in now. I'm gonna send you off without baggage. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, people. Just be mad. Be mad at me, but that's really not my fault. We're having a lot of baggage cart problems, okay? So that's just not my fault. There we go. All right, so the problem with that one was the baggage loading. We do need some more room there then. So what I'm thinking is I'm gonna scoot this over here. That should be fine. We're gonna... What's that? 747. Ugh. We're gonna scoot this over like that maybe? Oh geez, that's not enough time whatsoever. All right, fine. We're gonna scoot this over here. There we go. Hopefully that's enough time for it. I'm gonna have to move some of these around a little bit more. Because I don't like the way this is, you know, <sighs> you know what, we're going to move this back, there we go. We can move this up here, and we can then slide this, there we go. Okay, so maybe that's going to work a little better. We shall try that, obviously tomorrow, because today that's not going to work. So final approach, good, one is at gate, good, good, and these are en route, they still have a few hours to go. So no, however, we do have some money to work with. So, let's go ahead and let's see. We have to build foundation from this line, actually. Oh, shoot! <laughs> Just wasted a thousand dollars. Oh, that's not good. That's never good. All right, so let's go and do something like, um, it's supposed to be there, right? Yeah, good. All right, so we're gonna just build the rest of this in, and then I guess we can probably start building up. Sure, sure. Oh, I can't believe I just wasted some money. That's never a good feeling at all. Oh man, I just, I, I, I can't believe a lot of this stuff is ha happening right now. What, what the heck is going on here? We do have enough people actually, are you assigned to that? You are assigned to this. You're assigned to this and you should be assigned to both of them. Hmm, hmm, not enough people actually using these, are there? Not really. Interesting, I thought more people would be using these but it seems like that might not be the case. We probably actually do need some more people here. Cause I have seen a lot of people actually leave like, argh, super mad. So I guess some more ticketing is going to be okay. Let me just, let me just first save this here <laughs> cause I don't want to have issues here. All right, so, uh oh, oh whew. I thought we were gonna have some save problems too. All right, so good. Let's go ahead and get ourselves in a few more ticketing desks. So let's go for one, two, three, oh. Oh, okay, never mind, not there then. And let's get our conveyor lines in here. One, two, and three. There we go. Good. Whew. All right, so we're going to need some more staff. So let's just go ahead and hire three more staff members. One, excuse me? No, one, two, three. There we go. Good, good. So hopefully, you know, that's going to work out for us. We're going to have to actually redo the queues, but I don't want to mess with the queues just right now because we might end up with problems. Let's just go assign them to the pre-existing queue for now, and then later on we'll change things up if need be. All right, so let's see if this is gonna work out for us, because it wasn't before, uh-oh. Oh, no! Oh, that was what I was hoping would not happen, but it happened. All right, what is wrong with you? Waiting on package loading, uh-oh. What's up with you, baggage car? That one's, okay, that one's already set. This one's waiting on package loading, though. All right, so, yeah. Yep, that was exactly what I was worried about. Oh, man. All right, so we missed two flights. Not good. That was, that's a lot of money, actually. The one was 747. Um, oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Well, on the bright side, Smart Air did not actually terminate, right? <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, I am not happy about that whatsoever. All right, you know what? We can just ignore that and just continue building up. All right, so let's see. How much? Oh, jeez. That's going to be a very little by little thing. Um... You know what? Sure, that's fine. Twelve by t ten by twelve is fine. Just as long as nobody gets stuck in the walls, I am okay with that. Whew. Yeah, I think the loan was definitely what was getting people stuck in the walls because I've done everything except for change the queues and get loans. <laughs> as weird as it sounds, as weird as it sounds, I think that's the case. And it seems like people are uh, hmm, there's still actually way too many people here. Mm. I don't like it. I don't like it at all. We have very little money. Oh, well, you know what? Uh, just as long as the flights work now that we actually amended the schedule, it might be okay. Yeah, get rid of those walls because we don't need them. Good, good. There we go. All right. Things are working quite nicely now, so that's actually not that bad. Although, there's still a lot of people waiting to be picked up, but, uh, you know, we probably should actually get the COO. Uh, fine. Oh, we can't. I was like, wait, what? We can't do that? Well, we don't have the money. That's right. We, can't, we don't have the money. All right, I guess we'll get the CO as soon as we can afford it. Um, 5,000. Hmm. We're gonna have to wait a few hours. We're definitely gonna have to wait a few hours, because like I said, no loans. Which adds a whole new element to this, because I'm just so used to it being like, yeah, you know what, I don't have the money right now, I can get a loan, I'll just pay it off soon. But now we clearly cannot do that <laughs> at all. So, uh, a lot of patience is required. Ha, huh, there we go, we have the money now. So, Let's go ahead and dump our CO out in there. There we go. And let's go pour some research. We're going to have to do 
16,000? Well, at least we got there from that flight, but still, jeez. I just want to upgrade buses, seriously. Ugh. That's that's ridiculous. Okay, whatever. Um, let's see. How's security handling this? Because there's a lot of people in right now. Uh, this one has no queues, and it seems to be okay. Like people are honestly queuing instead of bunching up in like one little area. Wow, wow, they're actually behaving, you guys. That's really surprising. That is super surprising. All right, you know what? Fair enough. Fair enough. Let's see. So we're coming in at eight on that one, nine of the other ones. So we have to watch out for this one. Let's see. You're waiting on baggage loading, and that one seems to be going to do it right now. So this is only good. Okay, good. Although this one might get a little bit of a runaway issue. Oh no, never mind. This one's waiting. <laughs> Has to wait now. Good. Did it just? It straight up looked like it just drove off of that instead of flew it flying off. All right, so we have something coming in here. This one is waiting for way too many things. So we're just gonna go and send that off. Yep. Sorry, suckers. <laughs> uh oh. Uh oh. It happened again. It happened again. And if we end up with this one getting stuck, we are super screwed. Well... <sighs> what the heck do we even do at this point? We have one baggage car just sending to everything. That poor person. Honestly, that poor, poor person. Their their whole job is right now just making sure that everybody gets their baggage. Uh, we should be paying them more. <laughs> we should honestly be paying them more because that's just ridiculous. Alright, so now our job, since we don't have enough baggage cars, is watching to make sure that every flight is leaving on time. This one has until one... Oh, it's departing. Good. But we need gate A1 first. Okay, good. Both of them are leaving. Proper. So, it seems like we're doing okay at this point of the schedule. Maybe not the other point. Hmm. <laughs> what do we do, you guys? What do we do about the broken cars? Like, maybe if I reload, the cars won't be so broken? Maybe that's gonna be a thing? I don't... Wait, did that just come out of this one? Did this one break? <gasps> Maybe. Hold on. I'm thinking. The problem might be breaking the deadlock on the plane when the baggage car is on the gate. I know this sounds really, really like messed up, really weird, but I'm thinking that might be the case because I have been breaking deadlock on a lot of planes and I don't know if... Yeah, I have to keep a close eye on that. I would have to keep a really close eye on that. Anyway, regardless, we still have enough money right now that we can actually continue building this up. So let's just place the foundation. I'm going to pause right now just to make sure that we don't actually miss out on anything. Let's just do that. There. There we go. And got to check the flights. Let's see. One is coming in in half an hour at gate A1. A1. You're waiting on baggage loading. Um, Where is the guy? Where is the guy? Wait, where is he? He's not in his truck. He's not there. We're going to have to send you off. Sorry. He was the what? What was he doing? All right, whatever. So E1 is free. Uh, let's see. You should be getting your final approach. That's fine. You have a few more. Yep. I don't think you're making it, are you? There's a lot of people actually standing in line. All right. So that one seems to have not had either enough time or something. I don't know. There's still just a lot of people standing in line. All right. That one's uh still coming. All right. You're going out. Leave. I know. Yep. Yep. You're all really, really mad, but there was clearly some kind of issue there that we did not get enough people coming in time. Oh, good landing. So that was weird. This flight here was taking forever. That's not supposed to happen. That usually wouldn't happen. Hmm. Any idea what happened here, you guys? Because I honestly don't know. And the price that the builders are actually getting this, so that's good. Let's see. So next flights are coming in at 2130 and 2200. All right. 21.30, so you have an hour and a half up here. You seem to be almost done except for the baggage loading. Yeah, the baggage loading, jeez. Oh, boy. Okay, so that poor guy only is just <laughs> collecting baggage right now. So we have until 21.30, which is half an hour. Ooh, oh, it looks like he's actually going to do it. He actually did it, but there's still people coming. Are you going to... Oh, it's leaving. <gasps> it's leaving. So that the baggage guy... Dude, you really get paid like a ton more money. <laughs> All right, so um, we need this one to leave right now. It's leaving. Okay, good. So those last ones are properly spaced out. Thank freaking goodness. Oh, frick the baggage car. Seriously. Oh, seriously. All right. So let's go ahead and add ourselves some more foundation up in here. Let's see. How much more can we get? Ooh, a little bit more because we just got another flight. Good. So we're almost there, you guys. We're almost there. So as soon as we can get it up to here and then get the security in here, we'll be good to go, honestly. That's... It's not that far away. I know, you know, we're not doing this as quickly as we did at one of our past airports, but uh, it's, it's going to be okay. It's going to be fine, especially since we have 
obviously a lot of issues here. <laughs> a lot of unexpected issues, I should say, because clearly nobody expected this to happen, did they? Mm -mm. Ooh, ooh, not bad on that one. Definitely not bad on that one. All right, so there we go. That's that's how this is gonna work. We did swap around the schedule for today, didn't we? A little bit, right? So maybe we're gonna get some changes happening here. We shall see. We shall see how that's going to work. Let's see. No, actually, there aren't any changes. I'm like, did I change anything? I don't think there are. All right, so final approach coming in. All right, good, good, good. And two en route. Hmm, okay, that's a fair bit of money. These are gonna be fine. We have four hours between these two actually landing, so that's... I mean, what? That seems like it's enough time, but... Oh, that was really close. That was actually super close. I wasn't watching that one close enough. Oh my gosh, that got, like, super dangerously close. Oh, <laughs> oh never want that to happen again. Oh my gosh. Alright, let's get rid of this, because we're gonna just get in there. That's, uh, what is it? Ooh, a 10 by 12. That's actually gonna be affordable. Let's get, like, 60,000, was it? I think that's what it is. Alright, so 8 a.m. is when the next ones are arriving, and I think we might be okay. See that this poor guy actually doing all the work right now? Yeah, he's actually like right on that. So this is gonna leave as soon as enough fuel- there we go, gone. Perfect. You are supposed to be gone by 8.30, that <laughs> poor guy. <laughs> oh, hashtag props to baggage guy, seriously. That's- that's amazing. Okay, um... That's at nine. Okay, so you have a little bit of time to leave. There's still a lot of people. Oh yeah, there's still a lot of people actually not boarded up. Uh, are people actually? Oh shoot. Yeah, we need to leave now. We need to leave now. Get out. All right. So this is not enough time. So I need to actually start moving things around. Um, I'm gonna move this one back a little bit. And let's see. What else do we need to do? That was the wrong one, wasn't it? Wait, what? This is. I was like, this is not right. This does not look right at all. This over here, aha. So this is not enough time for that. So I'm gonna move this back like that. Um, that one leaves in time just as it is. So I'm gonna leave that as it is. This, I honestly don't know what to do with it. I'm gonna move it up a little bit more and see if that works because that one seems to be coming in always at the wrong time. So there we go. All right, did anything actually fail to reserve the runaway? No, it seems like it's fine right now. Okay, good. We have enough money now so we can actually build this foundation, so let's go ahead and do that up right in here. What? I thought we had enough. Okay, never mind. Um, we're close. We're definitely close. When's our next flight coming in? At one. All right, so we have like two hours to go. Hmm. Well, just as long as that one leaves, that's gonna be fine, because I don't want to miss any flights anytime. And yeah, we have a new schedule for tomorrow, so I guess we're gonna have to wait and see just how that goes. Alright, it's not quite tomorrow, just yet. What the heck happened here? Oh, are you kidding? Oh, that's unfortunate. That's really unfortunate. Yeah, but it's uh, not quite tomorrow, but we have the rest of this built in. So now it's just a matter of building out over here so we can get our proper security zone. Now, I wonder how much that's going to cost us to build a tiny, tiny security because I don't think we're going to need much, are we? Let's see. We want to build it up in here. So let's see. If we want to stretch this out over here, it's going to cost us that much. Mm, we'll actually get that a lot sooner than we think, right? Yeah, I think it's... We can probably just build like a super, super tiny area, but I don't want to do that. Let's um, uh, maybe build it up to like that. That might be fine. Yeah, I think 10 is probably fine. And we'll see how that works. But obviously we're going to need the money for that. And since we missed some flights, well, a flight? A flight? Yesterday. Oh, we missed two flights. Oh, and both were smart error. No wonder we weren't getting much money. Ugh. What's happening here? You've been waiting for forever. Waiting on baggage unload. Uh-oh. No. No, don't tell me. Don't. T no. No, 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 no. Okay, well, that means this is the end of this episode, because I think all the baggage cars are now stuck. And, uh, well, that's why the baggage is not getting unloaded. <laughs> well, that's a trip. So, uh, yeah. That's, that's, that's a pretty big bug, and, uh... Oh, jeez. I cannot believe that happened to all of them. Well, I'm going to just leave it there for this episode. If you enjoyed, hit that like button to share support, and do subscribe if you already haven't. But as always, thank you so much for watching, and have an awesome night.